My name is Ojota Obabatude. I'm one of the leading team in maize improvement program in NIT. In maize improvement program, we deal with production, basically breeding. In production, we'll be talking about land, seal to be planted, the land preparation, how to attain the yield agronomy practices, how to have a, a good yield output. When, we, when you plant, you plant at 25 by 75 cell, and then uh, for one hectare, in the one hectare, at two weeks, you apply an MPK OG 1515. At four to fifth week, you put urea that will boost the yield in terms of the maize output. The process goes like that. When the effect of a, any insect pest attack your field, you spray what we call an insecticide. It may be uh, Ampligo as an insecticide trademark, or it may be a sharp shooter. Any insecticide that can control a fall amium, a FAW. From there, the maize started growing until you retain its physiological maturity. Once you retain, you will have your shell at ground. You need to shell, you need to clean, you need to bag, and you need to rebrand. In that aspect, at my back, what they are doing now is the preparation for the maize breeding. You can see the envelopes are really showing at the back, in which they are doing an entries for them to prepare an R&D. The R&D simply means the replicate of the breeding, depending on the evaluation that we are going to the field to establish. Like the one they are doing basically is on Striga, where we'll be planting in an outside station with Abuja and Mokwa, where we infest a Striga. And Striga is a witch word, directly combined with the southern people in the northern part also. Likewise, we will, we will infest the Striga in there, where the maize will be planted. And then the breeding as well still goes to the field. Maybe from here, we can be moving to the field. Here we are at the field for the breeding aspect. As you can see, the, the, we have what we call an A line, which represents a male parent, while the female line. You can see there is no tassel here. The tassel represents male, in which we need to remove it to the tassel it before we were able to cross to introduce the male pollen, the pollen green. This is a pollination process where we will transfer the pollen to the stigma of another maize plant, in which the female aspect. This is the female aspect. That's why we cover it to maintain what we call genetic purities, to avoid an external pollen, to know that we are really breeding a tree to type that can really withstand strikes, bee drought, bee strikers, or e strikes. The likewise, uh, we maintain what we call a shoot cover. You can see the shoot cover was covered that represents the female aspect. This is the female aspect. We need to cover it to avoid an external pollen not to get there. And then once you cover the sheep will be out, they will bag the pollen grains and then it will be part of the female aspect. The ones you dried, we will harvest them line by line because it's a breeding work that it doesn't need to be mixed together and then they need to follow the due protocol for the genetic purities. These are the basic techniques that we'll do in the maize improvement program of IIT.